Good afternoon. This is Paula Ward, a.k.a. 22 Fit Mama. I hope you guys had a great weekend. I hope that any time you saw water, you drank it and thought of me. Um, anytime you saw bathrooms and thought of me, I'll go with that too. Um, the only place I should have probably done a live was in the fantastic porta potties at um, the Bolton Fair. They actually had the ones that showed up that looked like a fancy bathroom, hardwood floors. Um, they still were a porta potty, but you didn't know it. And um, I visited there about five times in the five hours that I was there. Um, so what I thought I would do this week is one thing I do is I will slowly kind of get back to like, obviously the summer things have crept in, the, the snacks have crept in, the ice cream, the processed foods, oh, bread, love bread. And um, a lot of times we'll do like, let's go a couple weeks and kind of give up something. Some people go cold turkey. They will clean out their cupboards. They will clean out their refrigerators. Uh, it doesn't work for everybody because then they go insane. Um, one, one way that I have done it, um, I've done it over three weeks, um, but I'm going to basically lump it into five days, six days, um, and tell you how I kind of go about cleaning out the diet. Um, and it'll go, t I'll start it tomorrow. Um, I will have it up this m in the morning early um, and have you guys ready to go. So if you want to join me, um, every day we will cut something out. And by the end of the week, we will see how we feel um, and what stuff you feel better being off, what stuff do you think probably didn't make a difference. Um, and also notice that if you add it back in at all, some things I found I was able to add back in, some stuff I can't. Um, so we are going to go tomorrow starting with water. We discussed water last week, so tomorrow I would like you to not drink soda, not drink iced tea, drink whatever water you're supposed to for the day. Um, check in with me, send me a message, uh, let me know how it's going, um, and I will give you some tips. Tomorrow's focus will be... Um, giving up soda, the benefits, um, what it does to you, why it's not good, why diet soda is not good, and is seltzer just as bad as drinking soda? Um, so all those things I will talk about tomorrow. Um, some of the other topics for the week will, day two will be no dairy, no sugar. Day three, four veggies, three fruits. Day, what am I, one, two, three, four. Day five, nothing in a box from bags or cans. And the last day, no alcohol, because we're going to go out with a bang. So I know it's kind of hard. Now, this doesn't have to be done today. And you could even take these things and do it over a couple weeks. Um, maybe take two of those, like basically spend a week getting all your water in. So, um, and then second week, um, get out the dairy and the sugar. Increase your veggies and fruits. Day th you know, Week three, no nothing from everything fresh. Um, and then, you know... Head out the alcohol at the end. Who knows? You may need it by the end of that. So um, that's my service this week. And we will clean up your diet. And I will give you some tips. I will let you know why it is good to get these out of your diet. And I hope this helps you um, kind of work towards getting back to school. I think in the summer we kind of are, um, we don't plan things. And then kids go back to school and we're going to go all in with our nutrition and our fitness and everything else. And sometimes it's very simple things. Um, that you can get out of your diet that lead to huge changes over a period of time. Um, and I've got some interesting stuff that I found that I had read um, about how that affects you and what it, what difference it can make. So, this is Paula Ward, aka Tutu Fit Mama, and I join you to help clean out your new, clean up your nutrition or like summer clean your nutrition um, before school starts and kind of get ready for the kids to go back. So. Um, and even for them, it's helpful. I know my kids, they've been at the Bolton Feral Weekend. I don't even I don't even know what Peter's drank or the amount of root beer that this poor kid has, seems to have ingested. And um, it's time to get it out of there. So let me know. Let me know what um, how it's going, who will join me. Um, and tomorrow we will talk um, about water and some of the beverages that people drink um, and what, what they can do to you and the um, ill effects it can cause. So have a great day. And I hope this helps you live your best life. Thank you.